thing we're gonna do is add our plywood rail bands to the board. Um, when you look at these, we've got them glued up, and remember, we added a pad to cover the puzzle joint, but the pad is just on the inside, and the inscribed side is the inside. Um, these lines up here represent frame one and frame two, and starting at frame three, there's a little notch that actually engages with the frames. So we're gonna look at this, we're gonna make sure to put it with the inscriptions and the pad on the inside and uh, start lining this up. And the way we're gonna put this on is we're gonna use little drops of hot glue at each frame that has a tab. Uh, we're not gonna hot glue frame one and two on this board just yet. We're gonna do that once we start adding the top planks. So um, you can dry fit this, make sure that these little notches fit over the tabs on the end of the frames, but they usually fit just fine. So um, I test fitted one or two and I know they're gonna work. So I'm just gonna start hot gluing them into place. And uh, I usually start at the wide point of the board. So I'm gonna start with frame four and then just work my way out towards the ends. So I'm gonna add a little hot glue to the frame. Slide that right on. And again, these are going to get epoxied on when we add our bottom plank. So the hot glue is just holding things for now while we work on things. Okay, we've got our whole frame set um, assembled and glued into position. It's nice and stiff. Um, our next step is going to be prepping to add the bottom planks to this frame. 